that's Bordeaux Saint Jean, a very impressive, very large SNCF railway station. Hello, and thanks for stopping by. Thanks also to all the new subscribers and, of course, the existing ones. I'm going to um, sit before you today and claim my place as a happy P-Line Brompton owner because uh, the trip to Bordeaux was a huge success. Now you're going to say, you Brompton owners, oh David, you're making a bit of a fuss aren't you? We do this all the time. But for me it was a first. Getting the bike and my big borough bag onto the train, uh, I was a little concerned. I thought, oh, it's, it, you know, supposing I can't see it, where were you? I put it, as you saw in the uh, film, up above my head very easily. Same with the Brompton uh, borough bag. Uh, no sweat. Everybody was doing the same. Uh, I didn't feel that I was inconveniencing, I'll say that again, inconveniencing anybody. The, the, the it wasn't a very long train journey, it's about an hour and a half. But it was a good test to see what's uh, coming up. YouTube analyst, yes, I'm, I'm referring to notes. I've got a memory that is like most of everything else about me failing. YouTube analytics tell me that after English, uh, my largest audience is American. And I thought for Americans and others, other nationalities, it might be useful to put up a map of where we are in Europe. And um, then again, another map to show you uh, Bordeaux, 
and I've highlighted that bridge that I seem so obsessed with um, in the early part of the video. So that might be helpful. Refers to notes. Oh yes. <laughs> Let me reiterate why I bought the Brompton. Put simply, it is an extension <clears throat> to my camera. I bought it simply, <coughs> excuse me, <laughs> it helps. And it's after 12 o'clock, so. An extension to my camera. And I didn't buy it to commute or to do um, bike packing or any of the things that many of you do. And one of the other things that I have noticed through the comments, many comments, thank you again, sincerely, for the comments, for taking part. Many of you are very technical. You love to undo bits of it and then strap on or bolt on rather other bits that you've bought in the aftermarket. Fine, fabulous and then do your bike up in all sorts of, you know, regalia. Fine, lovely. I have absolutely no intention of doing any of that. Um, the saddle on my Brompton is a physique, and I swear it is an instrument of torture. Nobody can possibly put their bottom on that for, well, anyway. That, if I were going to change anything, would probably be a temptation. But, as an extension to my camera on this little trip to Bordeaux, the Brompton P-Line Urban worked perfectly, and I'm very, very happy. And I'm enthused because I didn't make a mistake, and um, I, I'm happy and confident now to take on bigger trips going further afield, even possibly to other countries. Who knows? We shall see. And really, um, oh yes, the other thing I must sort of say is that this isn't a photographic channel, obviously, it's a bike channel. But I can't help but incorporate some of the photographs that I took, um, some of which I was very pleased with. And um, I couldn't have done it without the Brompton. Well, I could possibly have done it without the Brompton, but say getting on and off the the tram lines there are trams everywhere in Bordeaux but getting on and off waiting for the tram to come and all that sort of thing um, without the Brompton um, I think it would have been more arduous I don't think I would have gone back and forth across the city as many times as I did using bike lanes for the first time in my life I'm getting used to bike lanes and how other cyclists react. I had several encounters with uh, people that asked me about the Brompton. Uh, three ladies and one gentleman. Uh, it's a bit like if you have a dog, um, uh, people will stop you and ask you about your dog, I think. The Brompton seems to be like that. So it was all very pleasant, very agreeable. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm really happy. My challenge is, will I have enough to, to keep you engaged in this channel? Um, I'm not gonna take it apart. I'm not gonna put extra faster bits on it. I'm not going to go bike packing. Um, will I have anything to offer you? I think the future will um, let us see that. Thank you so much for joining me again and I hope you will uh, come back again for the next adventure. See you soon.